stop the fence and get to the front gate. He's throwing front gate to the groin. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm stopping it here with my foot. So this requires me to be fairly early, but it's great if I do it, if I manage to do this, because it keeps the kick far away from me. The other thing it does is, especially for wearing shoes, it's going to be very uncomfortable for him. He's going to kick the bottom of my foot really hard. I, you know, if you're wearing anything with a like heel, like dress shoes or platform or something like that. Stilettos. I was thinking that, but that would be a so tricky. That would hurt my job. But yeah. She! <laughs> hey! Ow! 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 I'm bleeding out from that kick. Yeah. The only problem there would be I, you know, I don't wear a lot of stilettos. I don't know about the balance on the other foot. Do you get a heel sporty? What? Do you get a heel sporty? Very nice. Only when I go out of town. I may go to the shop and maybe because probably you didn't have a look. It's hard to go in between the ball, the foot, and the heel. Okay. They're laying with the elbow. If you can throw a decent kick with stilettos, boy, you can do it. You're Nikita. You're good. Exactly. Oh, uh, ice skates. Out. <laughs> 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 your foot just goes, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> you chop your foot off. Or if you're wearing those shoes that are like, obviously, like the like eight, like six year old goth people wearing them, where the, it's about that big. You know? Kiss shoes, if you're wearing jeans. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, or golf cleats. Oh, yeah. Ow. Mm. Or the, the ones with, the, with like the live fish. <laughs> Fish attack! <Yeah. laughs> uh, anyway, right. So the point is, guys, the point is that it's a uh, it's a nice nice defense if you can pull it off here. It's very strong, it keeps the kick nice and far away from you, it causes a little damage to them, and it's very easy to follow up from. The thing that makes it hard is gonna be what, Cassie? Exactly. Uh, because I have to recognize the kick, get my foot up, and then have enough time to push it down a little bit. It's more than just raising up here. If I'm, if I'm raising my leg up and it kicks my foot, yes, I won't get hit, but I may get knocked backwards or something. I need to be able to equal his energy here. So I need to be able to settle over it this way. Um, another cool thing about this defense is you can start using it really preemptively. Go slow here. I'm actually getting above the Okay. I can go really early, and if I notice he's kicking, right, a lot of, he's doing a lot of kicks, then you just start hammering the top of the thigh. That's really nice. You can use it on the front leg, like that. Uh, here, even if he's not kicking, okay. you just kind of keep constantly hammering him here. Oh. It's pretty. It's relatively safe for me because it's quick. Um, it's really frustrating for him because he's kind of always getting stuffed, always getting stuffed. Um, it'll be a little bit longer than his punches, probably. Um, so you can just, man, just constantly be, be smashing people like that. Um, so it, it's a, it's a pretty cool technique. Yeah. You can get out earlier, so it's probably better than this, right? Uh, yes, because. The, the foot won't come as close to you. Right. Um, in fact, not only will the foot not come as close, but the whole body won't be as close. Right? If I'm able to stop this kick back here, his hands are also farther away. Whereas if the kick comes all the way through, now his whole body gets closer, including the other weapons. Um, and again, if you were really early, you go above the knee, just the thigh there, just crunch it. It'd, it'd be awesome. And then uh, you can do the jet lead, right? Just this. <laughs> That's one of his one of his better movies. Which one is that? Fist Lesson? Yes, the ending fight. The guy from the front he goes, he goes, oh, oh. there. He's really slick. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> 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 Alright, anyway, again, um, oh, so there's two options on, the, on this one. I prefer this way. The other option is here. Yes. Anybody feeling clever and want to explain what might be an advantage or disadvantage over those? What about it? And is that good or bad? So you're like this towards the you're small Right. You're also set up for a kick. And if you're sideways, if he if you miss, it's going to go right up into your crotch. If he's following through with the kick. And like, for, you, for example, if I went like over it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that, that would be very uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, I, I favor this one. It's a little faster. I don't like to turn my body. And uh, a lot of people will say the main detriment to this one is that if you miss, it'll go up to the groin. But really, if you miss, like how could you miss? Um, I, mean, I can see you not getting it correctly, but if it's coming to the groin, you put your foot in front of your groin, like there's no way for him to get his leg up there. You're more likely to miss a little outside to miss that way, in which case you could get hit on the hip or it could come up higher and hit you in the ribs. But if you do the block where it's supposed to go, you won't get hit in the groin. Um, now, of course, if you're late, that'll be a problem, right? But it's, yeah, it's always a problem if you're late. This one, people will say maybe it's a little stronger, 
and then um, they'll say if you miss, like if it goes outside, right? Like if I miss to the inside, then my groin is a little safer here. But you can still get kicked in the groin that way. And you have to turn your back, which I don't care for at all. Um, so I uh, and you only have half your weapons though. Yeah, it's really, then you're far away. You got to go all the way back. The just because their their back foot is stuck, they can still <coughs> jump hard with their front foot. Talking about the attacker? Yeah, the attacker. Well, and they can also you can also attack with this front foot, right? I mean, it, this could be against the front foot attack. So either way. So I, I don't care for this one much, unless I happen to be turned sideways already. In that case, I can do it. But as always, you should try them both. I mean, just because I don't like it doesn't mean it won't work better for you. Um, so try those out. Careful with the impact on the on the shin guard. It doesn't take much. Um, let's do this one. Back and forth on your own.